Welcome back, my name is Kerry, and today I'm going to show you a modern prefab home that up until a couple days ago, I had no idea existed. 2023 is shaping up to be a big important year in the prefab home industry, and I think we're going to see a lot of changes. Right now, there are a lot of new companies entering the space, turning heads and building excitement. However, we can't rightly forget about those with a proven track record run by people who probably have ginch older than some of these new companies just getting started. I spend a fair amount of my time surfing the net, sniffing out different options for people to choose from, and it's unbelievable unbelievable how many choices are out there. There are a bunch of styles from companies approaching the industry in their own way, so it's fun to see the similarities and differences on everything available. The company I'm talking about is called Adria, possibly Adria, with their line of modern prefab homes that are now available stateside. What I'm going to do is tell you about the company, check out their homes, and get into their pricing. Adria is a prefab home company that started building in 2002 and has since gone on to build 18,300 homes. They've sold homes into 30 different countries and have a fairly large line of prefab homes to suit a variety of different buyers. Their mission statement is comfort in nature, inspiring homes that reflect the modern lifestyle. What they've done is create a competitive advantage in the industry with their 20 years experience, continuous innovation, and the quality of the products they sell. They offer all the usual suspects that you can find from most prefab home companies including modular, mobile, and tiny homes. However, they also have an arm of the company that I haven't seen anyone else dabbling in. Glamping tents and floating homes, which you do see from others occasionally. Last time I was in a tent, I whiffed on the tarp placement and woke up to a river flowing from head to toe. This is not really the same as that though. I don't know a single solitary thing about glamping tents, but the floaters do look really cool. With those two options and throughout the rest of their offerings, they do seem to lean into the holiday aspect of these types of homes. They say their homes are designed to perform, stating, we understand the science of construction, the needs of our customers and the end users. We manufacture in world-class facilities and offer a systematic approach to mobile homes. Our construction methods and modular systems enables you to choose your peace of mind. Layouts represent an either a combination of performance, comfort, and privacy. Our homes are designed to perform with certified quality, built to perform, built to last. In 2002, Adria received a Red Dot Award, best of the best for their X-Line series of homes, and it's noted on their website that every year they're taking steps to become more environmentally friendly. They have recently invested in their own solar power plant that allows them to obtain most of their needed electricity in an environmentally friendly way. The way they have their business model set up is with a network of dealer partners located around the world who look after the logistics of getting the home from the factory to a location hopefully near you. That way, all the end user has to worry about is is finding somewhere to put it. What I like about that is it takes a lot of the legwork and stress away from the buyer. Their homes are built in Europe, so any concerns over things like shipping and importing are handled between Adria and the dealer partner, and once homes have shipped into North America, you just wander over and sign on the dotted line if that's what you wanna do. They've got a lot to look at, so let's take a quick peek, see, and I'll note which are available in North America and where you can get them. The first home I'm going to look at is their X-Line series because a few of them are already available in the United States. They're a modern looking home both inside and out with a tagline that simply says inspired luxury. On the description of all their homes it says no other mobile home provides freedom and luxury experience of an Adria designer mobile home. It's not just the location but it's the design, the space and the features. The exterior of the X-Line has a broad selection of cladding materials including wood, stone, metal and glass. First things first, I do like the look of the X-Line shown and it's noted that with the cladding materials offered and the color selections available, it's possible to customize the look to best suit the environment. That means you can take their larch wood and combine it with the gray metal or go with the black line with the bronze, just to name a few. Sky's the limit. The homes come with plenty of windows letting in that sweet, sweet natural light and something you don't see every day is a corner window. They're rocking it on two of the three models. The X-Line ranges in size from 345 square feet up to 435 square feet with two of the three models available in the US of A. Inside, the modern look continues and the description says the interior of the X-Line is marked by simple forms, long lasting durability and an unrivaled comfort. Each room was designed to live up to this promise which shows in the number of small details guaranteed to bring a feeling of high-end grandeur. The X-Line comes with two different finishes with innovative design elements, each of them inspired by its own distinctive style. Honestly, I can't remember the last time something brought me the feeling of high-end grandeur, 
but I assume it's feeling well. The two different finishes noted are the Avant Garde and the Scandinavian. The Avant Garde has rich dark colors while the Scandinavian is where you'll get the bright earthy tones with the occasional pop of color. All models have intelligently designed modular luxury kitchens with style and functionality. Everything you need in the right place with the best appliances. The smallest of everything in the X line is known simply as the 804. It's noted on the floor plan that it's a one bedroom, but unless I'm missing something, to me it looks more like a studio. It's possible that there is full separation here. Hard to tell. I think it's a partial wall. Either way, beyond that, they have a full bathroom for bathroom stuff. Up front is a living space with sliding doors outside, and finally the kitchen at the very front. Just when I thought I'd seen it all. I know for sure I haven't seen that floor plan before, and it is not one that will be available in North America, which means the next two are. Next, they've got the 905R21, which is a full-on two bedroom in 435 square feet. This layout has a front kitchen followed by the living room, which is in line with the smaller of the two bedrooms. I should note that at least in the homes available in the US, the furniture is included. I'm talking everything you see in the pictures, furniture, appliances, address, sound system, and towel heaters. Another way they're making the process simpler for people looking to buy because I'm a firm believer that buying furniture sucks. Some people might like it, but it's not for me. If somebody wants to handle that for me, I'm taking that option all day. At the end of the unit is the main bedroom and tucked into the corner is a bathroom that is accessed through both bedrooms. The final plan in the X line is the 905 C22, a two bedroom, two bathroom, again, right around 435 square feet. The C22 has a split layout with bedrooms on either end of the home, living room in the front corner and kitchen in the middle. Out of the three X lines available, probably my favorite model. I've been seeing comments requesting larger options, so let's see the biggest unit they currently offer. The biggest home currently offered by Adria is the Alpine Modular at 550 square feet. This is a little bit different than the previously viewed models because it doesn't come on wheels, so it's definitely a more permanent structure. The exterior of the home is offset, but with covered porches on both sides, it almost appears the same length. The result is a larger covered porch on one side and pretty cool look overall. One side of the home is the entire living space with the kitchen, then living room and access out to the porch. On the other side, the Alpine Modular has both beds bedrooms and the bathroom. Both bedrooms have access to their respective patios, so it would appear that the Alpine Modular is also geared towards a holiday style because that isn't something you see every day even though I do like it. They provide a full list of everything included in the home on their spec sheet, so if that's something you're interested in, you can find it on their website. So far, the Alpine Modular is not available stateside, but that doesn't mean it won't be at some point. Before I wrap this up, I am going to check out their pricing, but keep in mind pricing can and usually does change but will be accurate at the time of posting this video. The only prices I was able to track down were those that will be available in the States, which again are the 905 C22 at 175,000 and the 905 R21 at 185,000 and that's landed here ready to buy. From what I've heard, there are already homes in the US and there will be more arriving in the spring in Florida and North Carolina. Adria is a prefab home builder located in Slovenia that has dealers stateside in their network to sell their homes over here in North America. They've been around the block with 20 years experience in the business and have a modern look that I think will appeal to a lot of people. They definitely lean into vacation style living, but I think that's something a lot of people are looking for. Like I mentioned, I am fairly new to this company, but I do like what they got going on, so I'll be following along with what they're up to and posting updates right here on my YouTube channel. That's all I've got for today. If you like manufactured home videos, make sure to subscribe to my channel because I've got new ones coming out every single week. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.